Alright, welcome back to the site. I don't normally do voiceovers, but the uh, but this is just going to be a short, less than five minute video of our deep well installation. Uh, we started, and it's been a long process, we started about three months ago. And what you see here is there they're well into the drilling and what you see there now is uh, every every 12 or 15 foot of pipe they add one to it and then they use that mud mixture as a lubricant for the diamond blade uh, the coring coring bit and uh, they they went through several coring bits because there was a lot of a lot of rock, a lot of boulders. And here is a shot of the actual drilling. And uh, we got quite a quite a bit, several feet of you know solid rock in the shape of a tube. They, they pump that slurry mixture up into the pipe and then it goes down into the coring bit to lubricate it. Right here the guys are having a little conference uh, deciding how to place these uh, gaskets. There's, there's rubber o-rings that go in between each section of pipe so that slurry mixture makes its way down to the coring bit. And then fast forward, you know, three months later, we have uh, sunk our two horsepower pump, electric pump, down there. Uh, we ended up with 220 feet of depth, and we placed the electric pump at 180 feet inside this PVC pipe. And the wires you see are the the power and the and the control power and signal for the pump. And then each section of this plastic tubing is is sealed with a threaded and a, with an O-ring. And then they keep lowering that all the way to to the proper depth. being very careful not to drop it. That would be a, a gigantic disaster if, if that pipe was lost in there. So that's 180 feet of plastic pipe inside the 220 feet of excavated depth and there it is the the fruit of their labor very cold and clear water coming from the aquifer